This video going viral tonight, putting the Canton Police Department in the spotlight for controversial use of force. A neighbor took this video of a Canton police dog attacking a man who was already on the ground and appears to be in handcuffs. Although the man was on the ground, he was not in cuffs when the dog bit him. When I was watching it from over there, I really had a lot of anger build up. Just looking at him, just release the canine on him. All of us were screaming, stop it, stop it because we realized there was no reason for this. Today, what's going on? What is going on with the Playboy? There is a mission here. I'm going to get a cop card. And I'm going to get a trifold in every single car in America. You got to have a cop card in your wallet. You absolutely have to have one of these bad chickens. So I'm going to show you guys something right now. And I want to just, I want to get into this a little bit. <laughs> Hey, I'm about to put this guy in cuffs. Hey, hey, say, say one more thing to this dog. You're about to in cuffs. He's saying, say one more thing to this dog. Now, I'll show you what I have an issue with in a moment. Say one more thing to this dog. Say one more thing to this dog. That jackboot thug pig is concerned about that man saying something to his dog that he beats, that he abuses, that he tortures, that he teaches to be a very mean dog. This piece of shit pig, he is the one who abuses the animal, doesn't treat it right, abuses it, gives it treats for hurting people. The exact opposite of a dog's nature is what this JBTP does to that dog. And now he's concerned, he's concerned that this guy has said something to his little doggy said something hey hey say, say one more thing to this dog you're about to go in cuffs you're about to go in cuffs and why is that because you are an absolute jbtp that's what's going on you are an absolute jbtp so now let me show you where i have a real issue with this video let me show you where i have a real issue here it is He's under arrest for taunting the dog. Taunting the dog. Okay, now this guy, you may not be able to see it, but this guy complies. He very, very quickly puts his hands behind his back. He complies. They're up on his property. They're attacking him for him provoking a dog by saying something to a dog. That's where we are. But don't call them pigs. Whatever you do, do not call them pigs. They don't want to be called pigs. They can act like pigs. They can behave like absolute animals. But don't you call them a piggy. At that point right there, he's physically detained. But now watch the sick, sadistic, twisted F-U-C-K that this cop is. He wants to see the dog attack people. And this pig right here, this one right here, he's going to get the other two guys who have him completely detained and cuffed, he's going to say, get off him so the dog can attack him. Watch. He's yelling in their ear, get off, get off, let the dog attack him. He's pulling them off. They got him. He's in cuffs. He's got his hand on the back of his neck, pushing his face into the ground. They got him. <laughs> Jesus, criminy. He's biting the guy's butt like he's attacking this man who's in torture cuffs on the ground, face down, and they're screaming, stop resisting. He's laying face down in torture cuffs. Oh, my God. Got, the, the dog's got him by the forearm, and he's ripping his arm back and forth. A million dollars in surgeries is what it costs to get your arm fixed. Oh my god! You, you can see the puncture marks and the swelling already happening. You know, I don't see any... I, oh, there's no cuffs on him! 
but he kept his hands pinned behind his back the whole time, even as the dog was attacking him. Holy bejesus, are you kidding me? Are you watching this right now? Are you watching this? This sick, sadistic pig right here, take a look at him. This guy right here, he's the one that told the other cops, get off him and let the dog attack him. Why isn't he fired? <laughs> This JBTP, he says to the dog, good boy for biting someone who had their wrists self-pinned behind his back. I swear to God, I thought he was cuffed up because his wrists never came apart. Watching it back in slow motion with you guys, I see now there were no torture cuffs on him. He was just complying with everything he had. Even as the dog was ripping it to his arm, he never took his wrists from behind his back. Holy bejesus. A police officer is on administrative leave after he deployed his police dog on a man who was on the ground being arrested. The body cam video has been released. We want to give you a heads up. It is disturbing. Our Mitty Hicks has more from Canton, including reaction from residents. I'm about to put this guy in cuffs. This was the scene in the 1100 block of 16th Street Northwest in Canton Thursday night, involving police and residents, including 44-year-old Keevan Convert, who officers say was taunting their police dog. He was taunting their police dog because he said something? He used words? He's not taunting the dog. <laughs> taunting the dog? You're going to go on his property and arrest him? Done. We've lost it. We, we, we've lost our country. We've lost the Fourth Amendment completely. An unreasonable search or seizure. The Fourth Amendment is the right of the people to be secure in their papers, houses, papers, their, their person, houses, papers, and effects against unreasonable searches and seizures. Why can this cop just tackle him that way on his own property? Why, why, why is that allowed? I thought that we had the right to an to to be free of an unreasonable search or seizure why in the world explain it to me why can this cop attack this guy like this i i i just i, I just why can he do this why is this why is this allowed if we have a fourth amendment right then this shouldn't be allowed <laughs> Come on, come on, get off him, get off him. But he's still got his wrist. Stop resisting! We're freezing the video here, but this went on for 15 seconds. The Canton police officer who deployed his canine is Officer Nicholas Casto. He has... Nicholas Casto, not Castro, but Casto. Nicholas Casto. Look at him. Just if you want to see, and, and, I, and I've said this a thousand times, the canine cop, when you, if, if your uncle, your brother, your friend from high school your college buddy, if they're a canine cop, they're a sick, sadistic, that's what they are. You have to be sick and sadistic to want to take man's best friend and make them an attack animal. And that's what they do. This guy right here, Jonathan Casto, he had to abuse the dog to get him to be mean to people. If you got a dog that bites, you abuse it and it'll bite more people. If you got a nice dog, if you don't abuse it, it won't bite anybody. This piece of right here, this guy is a sick, sadistic, straight up, he's sick and sadistic. He's disgusting. This is the worst of the worst human beings in our country. You're looking at him right there. Has now been placed on administrative leave. Administrative leave. What about the black cop that cleared the other two cops off the man as the guy was complying and putting his... What about him? The other two guys, they're told, jump off, jump off, jump off. They're in the heat of the moment. Maybe they get a slight pass. Maybe they just get suspended for a month. But the other two should be fired and brought up on charges. 
and not wrongdoing, fired and brought up on charges. Fired and brought up on charges. The man you saw being arrested, Keevan Conver, has been charged with resisting arrest, disorderly conduct, and obstructing official business. Look at that guy. He looks like a psycho. The Fifth Amendment cop card is the only card you need in your wallet when you see a JBTP. Remember, cops are not your friend. If you're walking down the road and a cop interacts with you, the moment you see the cop, you get the yellow card in your hand. You have to have a pair of Fifth Amendment cop cards in your wallet at all times. If you carry your credit cards in your phone, it's the exact same size as your visa, as your driver's license. The number one defense that you have against these JBTPs is your camera and the Fifth Amendment cop card. Thanks. My name is Chilly Castro, and I am Delete Laws.